Sharing the Message of Love and Peace, Part Seven of Seven, on Between Master and Disciples, given in English on May 29th and 30th, 2007, in Sankt Kanzian am Kloppeinasi, Austria. Peace for Ukraine or Ukraine now, Russia, just go home. from other people, from each other. Okay. It's not a place to show off your figure, huh? No. <laughs> you're free, but why here? <laughs> Don't need to. Oh. Hey, very good, huh? Okay. Well, now we're going to plant something outside there. Yeah. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> I think we're going to plant some big trees or some medicine tree, the hedge to cover up a little bit so we can walk inside and nobody see us. Yeah. It's so empty now. Yeah. <laughs> Very empty. Yeah, we have to plant something. Mm-hmm. Now look at this uh, lady. huh? Hey, look at that. Who look at her? What? <laughs> May I have, uh, ask practical uh, advice what to do if I got too much air in my hair? Too much air in your hair? <laughs> they have some you can sprinkle on and make it look like your hair. <laughs> they sell those. You just spray it on evenly. Spray it on and you have full hair, at least for TV. Nobody touches it. On TV, they have the spray? Yeah, yeah they, it, they did something like this. They did? Uh-huh. Then it's once, okay. Yeah. Why once? I could do anything. Look at that now, she looks so nice. Hey, come on. <laughs> Pictures, huh? Who say what? It so, so much better. Yes, you see. Soft and nice. Feminine, okay? It's cool, like that. Translated it. 10 hours and after the translation, we record, um, had recording, so. Tired, huh? Yes. Wow. That's why you run away. <laughs> <laughs> Too much work, huh? Yes. Um, it's not much work. I don't know why. I don't know. I think I need a rest. Over oh, well, there, just work and no fun. <laughs> no. Right? We had fun. No, also. Could be fun. Could be yes, fun. We had fun. I had fun. Yeah? <laughs> you? <laughs> Good. It depends on how, how passionate you are about this kind. Sometimes I'm also very tired because of working, you know, with <laughs> egos. But uh, I have to, yeah, because of the world, yeah, because of everybody. Otherwise, do you think I enjoy all this uh, mundane domestic uh, work or secretary job? <laughs> yeah, every day I have to read what you read. <laughs> Tons of them. Yeah. Read through and correct them, see if anything needs to be erased. Yeah. Just words, no pictures. Oh, yes, look at this woman, nice. And I didn't do much. I just tied up your hair. If it's too fluffy, you tie it up like that. Yes. Or you put a little bit of uh, mousse or those uh, uh, to sculpt your hair, yeah. and you flatten it with a towel or something, and then after all, it just stays like that. Yeah. Yeah. It should look better anyway. Oh, I'm amazed too. <laughs> she looks nice. She's not skinny at all. My God, on TV she looks like some starving. <laughs> Stop in major. <laughs> if your forehead is too bright, you know, too long, yeah. and if you do it on side as well, then your face looks long and skinny. Yes, yeah. yeah. So it covers a little bit, makes it softer, right? Okay. That's all. Otherwise, your head was too square on the television. Are you not going back there anymore after I did your hair? Yes, I'm <laughs> I think I will do. You go and look at the big, big okay. bathroom. Yes. <laughs> I could do more than that. Oh, no, no, don't, don't move it too much. <laughs> I could do more than that, but just right now, even to one side, you use this and look at the side of your head. It's beautiful. You should not cover it. 
Because if you cover this, your face looks more long and more square. You're going to look at the side now, okay? okay. okay. Look at that one on the side like this, yeah? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I could make more miracles, it's not. This is just a quick one to show you that it doesn't have to be the way it was, yeah? <sighs> my God, IQ is what I need for my people, not ego, but IQ. It's trouble, trouble. You know the problem? <laughs> Sometimes with hairdressers, they want to do what they want, you know? And they think they're right, they're, they think they're professional. It's not necessarily good. But not everybody knows what to do. You know, sometimes if I go to a hairdresser, I'm also very uh, agitated. That's why I'm lazy to go. I, I do most things myself. I don't go anymore. <laughs> Unless it's a good hairdresser, if you go there, they ruin your hair, you know? Yeah, they ruin your face also. They just learn one or two styles, you know, and they're fixing it. They just make it quick so that the next customer comes. So I don't know if maybe one of those come into SMTV. <laughs> to be a, a hairstylist there, you know? So sometimes it becomes very different. <laughs> so after I saw some of the... Uh, I didn't know how to tell them, you know, because remotely, how do you tell a person how to make, you know? So I had to draw a little picture and I told the, the guys, you know, you have to do your hair like this and don't cut here so that your face doesn't look too too long and skinny, <laughs> and now it's better. And yeah, they do look better a little bit, no? Yes. The skinny guy <laughs> looks better, yeah. Mm. Yeah. Okay. I don't know what else to say. It's ten thirty. What do you want to do at this time? Nothing. Meditate, huh? Talk. Talk. To you. Talk. Tell me. <laughs> what do you want? <laughs> <laughs> you mean listening? <laughs> I mean, I have to tell you stories and all stuff. I'm tired, baby. I have to do something else. Is it softer now? You look pretty. Thank you. Not just soft. Yeah. You look very pretty. Your face is more feminine, round, and nice, very casual. Yeah. It's simple. Thank you. But maybe you like that style, and I don't mind. Whatever you like to do with this, it's okay. But you don't have to make yourself look older than you are. I'm old. Uh, oh, no, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you don't look old now, huh? <laughs> don't have to. <laughs> well, I mean, you don't have to, to make yourself look more square than you already are. <laughs> you see, hair makes a difference, huh? Hair yeah, can make you fatter, skinnier, you know, younger or older. Yeah. Like you, she makes herself also a little old, but that's nice also, you know. You have all your hair up and you feel fresh, I know that. I also do that all the time. You know, it's not pretty or anything, I don't care, I just make it all up like this, you know. Oh, this feels good, huh? <laughs> this feels very, very, uh, no, no, no. No obstruction, you know? I like this, yeah, very simple. After you wash your hair, you put some uh, hair sculpture gel, yeah? Oh, yes. A little bit. Yeah. And, then you, and then you do what you want with your hair. It will flatten down. Mm -hmm. You have to take care of it. You need condition and <laughs> vitamins, mm -hmm. yeah? Mm -hmm. They're not expensive, a few dollars in the shop. After shampoo, you have to put it on. And then your hair will stay where you want. I don't do much with my hair, but after I shampoo, you know, I just put it like this, mm -hmm. and then when I put it out, it's wavy, like I go to a coiffure, huh? Yeah, it's different in L.A. My hair was very dry, my skin uh -huh. was very dry. Yeah, in L.A. It's, it's dry. It's really very, very dry. Yeah, L.A. is a very uh, dry city. I don't know why. You have to put cream like two, three times a day on your yes. body, otherwise go wrinkle it. Yes. yes. It's very cold. Very dry. It was the desert before, you know. Yeah. Yeah. But people like it very much. I don't know why. <laughs> people like LA. A lot of people. That's why it's a big, big city. Because the climate is mild. 
in winter it's only 13, 14, 16. Yeah. And then uh, because it's dry, it doesn't have rheumatism and all that stuff. I so, so all people like like that place, yeah, like California. Mm. Huh. Yeah. Could they have a professional hairdresser? They have. They do now? That's the problem. Because <laughs> <laughs> I like tell you. Before, the, the, the young people that went there from Geneva, they were so shocked because they said every time before they have to go on, mm -hmm. somebody with a brush would just sort of go like that, you know, and then they looked really not very natural. Mm -hmm. It wasn't the hairdresser, no, no. It must be the hairdresser. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, I have told them a little bit what to do. I hope they change. They did change some already, you know. The Korean came back to normal, <laughs> at least. And uh, the skinny guy got better, and the other guy is love, love. I just have to be there in order to take care of everything where I can, okay? So we just have to take it the way it is. Yeah, yeah Master, yeah. can I ask you, are these your design? What design? Your earrings. Why are they your design? No, no, no. Oh, no. Why? Okay. Why? Okay. You like it? Yeah, I... No, 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 no. <laughs> 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 Maybe they're your design. No, no. they're design already, so I don't have to. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't even care about the design too much. Just just the change. Let other people also make money now. <laughs> okay. See you later. I will take care of some other things. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. You meditate, all right? Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Mm. It's not easy to have all these jobs. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thank you. 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 I'm sorry that I don't always stay here, so you can have some candy. Oh, very heavy. Wow, I'm telling you. Okay. How about they share it themselves, eh? Because if we make noise, yeah. they'll come up. And <laughs> <laughs> yeah. and then we have to laugh. <laughs> and sing love songs. <laughs> yeah, you give to our brothers. <laughs> Maybe I can. I have to go. Don't worry, I love you. What's your name? Sure. Yubo. Mejobo. Yubo. 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 How you know? Um, because I'm not here. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> it's Yubo. That's a very expensive name. Oh, you. <laughs> Check you out. Check if you're still here. You stay here too today? 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 And you? Stay for a while, huh? It's your home. Really, you stay as long as you want. No problem. Okay? Okay. Mm -hmm. But it's too cold to go swimming. <laughs> <laughs> now that there's not too many people, you can take a shower. <laughs> okay? Warm shower, yeah? And it's very cold. I feel cold. Huh? Huh? No? Oh, maybe because I got a cold. I don't know why I'm so sensitive. You guys have no problem, right? Huh? Yeah. I mean, this, doing... this room is also very warm, Master. Uh huh. Oh, this room is warm, of course. Yeah. yeah. Well, my room is also warm, you know, but. You know, I feel very tired <laughs> because of the cold. Now everybody's gone, I can afford to get sick now. <laughs> Yeah, but then there is no problem. I haven't done anything, I'm not going anywhere, you know? That last day was too hot here for you as well, uh -huh. now it's cold, so it's a cold test. You mean hot, cold, hot, cold? Yeah. yeah. And I got a cold? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. But how about you? It's no, I, I think it's just side as well, too. Too from the air condition? Uh, yeah, maybe. <laughs> maybe a little air condition here, huh? Well, I want to go to sleep. <laughs>
check out a little bit, okay? There's some candy for you, yeah. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's My God, getting worse now. The candy is not as good looking anymore. <laughs> because everybody's gone, they do cheap on us. <laughs> but you will like it, huh? Yeah. Everybody takes some. Hmm? Oh, thanks for everything, Master. I go sleep. Russia, go home. I started looking into veganism because a lot of endurance athletes were vegan. The more I researched it, the more it started making sense to me. Matthew Pritchard, vegan. <laughs> 